Hey guys, I'm just on my way back from uh, the doctors uh, in McConnellsburg and I figured I'd bring those guys along for the ride and let those guys see some of the sights. Uh, I'm not sure whether this is going to be a one or two parter. I'm actually traveling from McConnellsburg back to Shea Gap and it was a very historical site along the way. And I'll see if those guys know what it is. Right up here on the right is uh, Reamsburg Service Center. Of course, right there is the state police station. So I'm definitely going to have to watch how I'm vlogging. Have a having the state police this close. the doctors today uh, they forgot to give me my tetanus shot whenever I had my foot done yesterday and well just had to get back for a, had to drive about 45 minutes for a two second shot but isn't that the way things always go said about the historical event that happened uh, on this route. If any of you remember uh, the Taking of Peggy Ann Bradnick movie, uh, I believe it was The Mountain Man or Bicycle Pete or anything like that, uh, we'll actually be passing the place where Bicycle Pete AKA the Mountain Man was actually shot. And I'll show that to you when we get to it. As you can tell uh, on this 
road here it's not very wide and a lot of tractors and trailers run it this little turn is that we're going through right now I forgot to look at the the sign back there to, there to know what turn it is here in about a, a mile we'll be coming up on uh, the Fort Littleton uh, interchange for the uh, for the uh, Pennsylvania Turnpike Hotel there. A lot of people that's traveling on the turnpike like to stay at. Of course, right there is the turnpike interchange. Right there. Well, oh, guys, I'm going to cut this one off and I'll have a part two uh, to this travel where we will definitely see the site where the mountain man was actually shot.